Hello, welcome to Scratch 3D Printing. This video, I'll be attempting to take apart or kind of disassemble my Ace Pro from Incubic because for the past couple of days, I've been trying to print with TPU, which is a flexible filament like this, and I cannot get it to print. And unfortunately, it got clogged or stuck in the Ace Pro. Let's scratch to this problem. For the past couple of days, I've been trying to print with TPU and other types of materials, but I cannot get to other types of materials because every single time I start a print on the Cobra 3 it keeps giving me this faulty error saying that it does not recognize what material is inside the Ace Pro so it keeps giving me the error and when I click resume printing it does the same thing it's gonna extrude on the nozzle pulling the TPU in but for whatever reason it could not pull the TPU I will demonstrate what happened on the Ace Pro when it's trying to extrude. I can't get this printer to start printing TPU anymore because like I said it got clogged or jammed in the Ace Pro. I can't even pull out the filament and that's why I cut this strand of filament off from the Ace Pro. And this is gonna be my first time kinda disassembling the Ace Pro so it's not gonna be like the best tutorial for disassembling, assembling, or troubleshoot because first time working with the Ace Pro and I don't really know what's gonna happen so let's get up there and get a hands-on experience with the Ace Pro from any cubic that can't even print TPU okay so this is what happened right now this is TPU filament and as you can see here it got stuck in there right I cannot pull it, I cannot push it here is just regular PLA and I can move it easily. I was trying to print with PTG but I couldn't get this thing to unstuck. And I can move this easily. Same with this PLA right here. But I can't remove this. As you can see over here, this is a tube for the TPU. And I took it off, tried to manually pull it. It doesn't work. I took this off and I cut it right here because it cannot extrude or retract. So I just cut it off and try to manually pull it, but I still can't. I'll show you exactly what happened when I print with TPU. So usually when you print with the Ace Pro on the Cobra 3, it extrudes the filament to about like that. And then on the print head, it extrudes. And this thing slowly goes in like this. So when it gets about something like this, it extrudes more filament and then this thing pops back out. So it repeats the process like that over and over. <laughs> But for this, it could not do that. It cannot push out at all because the filament is way too flexible and it doesn't really have the strength, I guess, to push this thing out like this. So it just kind of gets stuck like this and then just go extrude, go extrude like this. And it detects that the filament is tangled inside of the Ace Pro. So it cannot push this thing out and you cannot extrude on the printhead. So the Cobra 3 gives you the error. So when that happened, it tried to extrude this, and then it does with this, does with this, and with this. And then it gives you the error. So this is stuck in there. So I'm going to attempt and try to take this off and see what happened. I'm going to take off this screw and this screw, and let's see what happened. Okay, first screw is over here. Put it right here. Okay, let's see if I can take this off. Is there like any more screw here? I don't want to break this. Okay, there we go. So you kind of lift it up and push towards the filament because it has these type of locks in there. And here is just glued in to keep it completely sealed. And what you look at that. Look at that. That is very interesting, man. It's so cool. Looking at these stuff, it just looks so cool. Zoom in a little bit. It has four pins for each individual extruder motor. And then down here, I think it's built driven right here. <laughs> that looks so cool. It has bearing right here. It has sensor it has all these cool gears in on the inside wow this is so cool try and take this piece off not quite sure if this is the best way to do it now i got this piece off which has two bearing in here there's two screw right there not quite sure if i need to take that off i didn't realize there was two screw in here Okay, it looks like it's very loosened right now. Okay. So, yep, I cannot take this off. Didn't need to do that for the other one. 
just look at that that's where the film goes in at first when you plug it in here that's it's like a guide for the filament oh okay so if it's the first filament i think it's gonna spin here so that this bearing here touch with this filament and then it can extrude and then once it goes over here this thing moves up like this and that's where the second thing and over here it's gonna rotate all the way like this so that that bearing is hitting the filament and same thing with this piece over here so this thing rotates to whichever filament is getting extruded <laughs> that is so cool okay but how is it stuck do I need to go deeper? I don't want to take these off because I feel like if I take this off, it's going to ruin the gear and I will have to reassemble everything. So I'll just see if I can pull this or something. Maybe I can push this a little bit. Or I could push through. Oh, right there. Hopefully you can see that. For whatever reason, it got tangled in like this. Wow. Oh my gosh. It got feed in like this. And then it just got stuck right here. It's like a loop. It's It got stuck in a loop in there. Oh my gosh. The TPU is just so hard to work with, to be honest. It's just so flexible. But I don't think that's the cause of the problem. Because I extruded so much out of my print head. And I can extrude fine. But when I print, like I said, it's just so flexible, it cannot push out enough so that my print head can actually print and it just give me the error. And then I keep extruding a lot and a lot and eventually it just go tangle like this and then get stuck. But now I got it off and we know how to get this thing off. <laughs> so yeah, I don't think there is any way that I'm going to get this off by pulling it, by pushing it without removing this thing because this hole is way too small for this tangle to even pop up and this is sitting very tightly in there so it's so it's a requirement that i actually took this off and i get to see the inside of this thing which look crazy cool okay now let's get everything put back together and let's wrap this up Go. got it fixed so I'm gonna keep trying attempting to print with TPU okay as you saw there it got tangled a little bit but it wasn't from the roll of filament it just from the filament itself it got twisted in the process of extruding the filament and I have no idea how or why it even got tangled like this and like I said there's no way I'm gonna be able to pull this out or push this through because the hole is just way too small without taking that piece off there's no room for clearance so that I can pull this apart and it's very interesting the design of that is very cool first time I actually see one and I actually want to compare to other types of multi-materials system but yeah like I said been trying to do some projects with TPU for two days now and I cannot get it to print at all before this clog even happened the Ace Pro cannot push TPU filament in there the little piece that comes out I showed you earlier that piece can't come out at all. It just come out a little bit and then it goes back in because it is extruding and the Ace Pro cannot push TPU out. And TPU is so flexible, it doesn't have the strength, I guess, to push out that piece out of the back of the Ace Pro. Yeah, that's the problem that happens with TPU. And I heard people saying that they can't even print with PTG because it's just clogged. And I tried ASA, it got clogged like a huge blob. And yeah, it's just a mess. But I would definitely do more testing. I would try to print with more types of filament and see what happened with the Ace Pro. Because ASA can't really be printed, I guess, I would try it again. TPU can't be printed and PDG maybe. PLA works really great, but other types of filament are that great. But who knows? I haven't tested yet. So I'll be doing that and stay tuned for it because I think it's going to be very interesting. That'll be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below. Have you printed with TPU on your Ace Pro and other types of filament? And if so, does it work for you? Is it fine? Does it print fine? Does it give you any error? Let me know in the comments down below. 
leave a like on this video so that it will reach more people showing how to disassemble the Ace Pro and kind of knowing that TPU aren't printable yet on the Ace Pro. Yeah, if you want to see that video, subscribe to the channel and as always, keep on 3D printing.